Well, he has got a ton of clubs today. Look at that Tommy armor bag. That thing is awesome. Give me twenty dollars for all of them. <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> Got the one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, that's my, her favorite. That's my <laughs> wife's a hoarder. <laughs> <laughs> I think I talked to you a couple weeks. All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are headed into the flea market. Before we get started, though, just want to say thank you to everybody who left positive comments on our 90,000 subscriber special. And stay tuned, the Scotty Cameron will be given away next week. And if you don't win that, no worries, we got a bunch of giveaways that we're gonna have the rest of the year. You definitely wanna stay tuned. Stay tuned, but uh, let's see what we can find at the flea market today. How much is your golf bag? 10 bucks, but just on the bag. Just the bag, 10 bucks? Yeah, cool. And clubs, we just do like dollar each on those. All right, I'll do uh, your bag. Okay. Thank you. That thing is awesome. A Michelob oh. staff bag. Yeah. Yeah, that thing is awesome. Yeah, it is. <laughs> now we gotta fill it up with some clubs. Yeah. <laughs> People are already jealous of my bag. It's Yellow Truck Guy's bag. How's it going? Hey, we're on the bag. Yeah, we gotta fill it up. <laughs> there ain't much out here, man. Yeah, I didn't see that so far. Got anything new or different? The what? Y'all been selling anything? Yeah, we've been doing pretty good. I ain't up to him. It's half the fun. Yeah. You the never mystery. know. Can you find the hammer? I'll tell you what I did. Was, I had this one. It was TP edition. And it had an evolution shaft in it. Oh, nice. Guy come by and he said, I'll give you 100 and a quarter for the shaft. Okay. I sold. <laughs> so I got a mark out way down. Yeah. It is brand new as a TP. Oh, nice. But I put it, just put the yeah. stock shaft. I actually it. used the the model that came out, or the, the year before this one, the M2, the 2016. It's one of my favorite drivers. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, I hate to sell the shaft, but I hate to turn down a button before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got a, it's in there somewhere. I got a pretty P30. Oh, yeah, it's good. Hey, at least you know they're by the shafts. Huh? I've got your you're shopping by the shafts. <laughs> What's an FG tour? Mm -hmm. Might be something you can sell online. I don't know. It's not. Oh yeah. Oh, that's yeah. literally the driver I switched from. Yeah, that's... I went from that to the M2. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually we found. Uh, that's my like first set. We found a lady set at Goodwill. It was like it was like the like previous model so yeah. it was like It'll basically brand new G, well, mm -hmm. year later, the yeah. G, this oh yeah that. but how much are you looking to get for that oh i'd sell it to you i got it 100 and a half i'd take 100 quarter 100 and a quarter you <laughs> actually i take 110 deal i'll cut you so you can sell it and make money on it okay we can do that. I mean, you make money too. <laughs> you can't get 150. I think it'll bring 175. Yeah, especially it's in really good condition too, and it's all stock. Mm -hmm. And with head cover. All right, we'll see you again, definitely. All right, if you don't make no money, bring it back. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> have a good one. I like it when they have the uh, flea market out here because we can just run to the car in between everything. Yep. Very convenient. I'm good. I don't have the butter dish. <laughs> That's a crazy daisy one. Yep. Ms. Holler, can you need prices? Awesome, thank you. What are you getting on this guy? Uh, 10. 10? I can't resist at that. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I'll, I'll get your buy my butter dish. <laughs> I'll buy your butter dish. Where's the stuff? I do have newspaper. Okay, oh, great, thank you. That's a pattern that I my wife does not collect. Oh, really? Yeah, that's my, her favorite. That's my <laughs> wife's a hoarder. <laughs> <laughs> I think I talked to you a couple of weeks yes. ago. Yes, yeah, I had a bunch of Fire King stuff. Mm -hmm. Hey, good luck today. Thanks. Thank you. See original Nike driver. Oh, nice. <laughs> How much are your golf clubs? How much is it? How much do you want for it? Should be on the day. 
Oh, okay. They're cool. 12. I'll do 10 bucks on them. 10? <clears throat> yeah, I can do that. You can get that. <laughs> All right, great. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good day. Oh, look at that old Wilson bag. Power stick. Power stick. Okay, uh, King Cobra SS9 wood in there. Multi-compound group. You had me at Cobra. <laughs> See if they sell this one individually. Mm -hmm. How much is your golf club? This is five dollars. Five dollars? Yeah. How much is your PS2? This is I'll say one hundred twenty-five. One twenty-five? Yeah, but this, 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 and this. Okay, thank you. How much you pay for the PS2? Uh, that's good. Mm. I'd probably be more around 75. So Check it. Is it how much? 75. For the, all of this, they gave five dollar. Look, Lado, have a Lado. Yeah, it's fine. I, just, I don't play that much, so it's okay. <laughs> Give me 95. 95. Yeah. You know if it works? This works perfect. Guaranteed. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'll think about it. Thank you. Thank okay, you. take it for 80. Take it. Five dollar more. Look, everything is good. The games. Yeah, we can do it for 80. Okay. <laughs> Came in for a golf club. <laughs> <laughs> Came here for a golf club and we're leaving with a uh, whole PS2 thing. So if it doesn't work, we'll find you out here again next week? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. You remember. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We this usually buy golf stuff from you. Yeah. We for the gold. How much? Give me twenty dollars for all of them. <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> this is all we want. <laughs> yeah. All right, cool. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. We'll see you again. You're great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's more golf clubs over there. Oh, we can get a lava lamp. Maybe we can bundle that with the golf clubs. <laughs> Got face forward wedge. One iron down there. Where? Right there. I think it's part of this. Uh, Dollar a club today. Okay. Kit's bag right here, five bucks, SpongeBob. <laughs> oh, wow. That's cool as hell, isn't it? Uh huh. SpongeBob bag for five bucks. With the Cobra Ricky Fowler. <laughs> yeah, we'll set that to our niece. That's cool as hell if you got a kid, you know. Mm hmm. It's got a couple of nieces that might like it. It's nice for five dollars. Got a handle, got a, got a strap, put it around your uh, back there. Mm -hmm. carry. It's pretty neat. Let's go in. All right, there you go. You sold us. <laughs> cool. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Put that over your back. <laughs> there we go. We'll fill it up. I got clubs too, but I don't know what it needs. Yeah. I yeah. Think they have... Those are kids' clubs, but they're a dollar each. Okay. Yeah, we got enough clubs, but this thing is cool. <laughs> thank thank you. you. People are just selling this stuff today. <laughs> this thing is kind of cool, though. I'm sure one of the nieces will like that. These are tens. Uh, I think so. <laughs> My size. I always like the. How much? The lettering on the bottom. You can do that. All right, here you go. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Well, he has got a ton of clubs today. Look at that Tommy armor bag. Ooh. That thing is awesome. I've never seen that. I think it's the most club he's ever had out here. <laughs> got a Callaway Hickory. That's pretty sweet. There's like six Vokies back here. Oh, really? Yeah. Here, you want to hold this one? Yeah. I'm running out of hands already. Sweet. SM4. I have one hand. <laughs> you got one hand? <laughs> I think it's like a whole bag of just big Berthas. I don't know if it's a full set of any of them, but there are. Yeah, because there's another big Bertha over oh, there. Oh, yeah, you got I the 10 it's... iron. I think that's a two... Oh, there's two 10 irons. 10? <laughs> 10. 10. Just in case you uh, get mad at it, and you need get another one. one. Got the other yeah. <laughs> Hogan. Hogan CFT. What else do we got? Oh, it's kind of like overwhelming how many clubs he's got this week. Yeah, especially since I don't have hands to pick. Oh, there's a uh, is that a full set of the Hogan Forge GSs? Uh, almost. I don't think. Oh, actually, it might be because it's under here too. I don't think it is. Yeah, there's. I think, I think it's missing this. I think it's missing the, the equalizer. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Usually it's missing the uh, seven. <laughs> K 
Callaway XR or Callaway Steelhead XR with a hazardous shaft, multi compound grip. All right, how much do you want to get for these three? Oh. Papa. Ah, oh, you gonna make me hit you hard, man. <laughs> How about seventy-five? Boy? Seventy-five. Yeah. That sounds good. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Here's the guy that always have me on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> George, you always talk about. Yeah. <laughs> always talking about you guys. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hopefully yeah. good things. <laughs> yeah. All right, that flea market never disappoints. Yeah. That was the busiest it's ever been by far. There yeah. was tons of vendors, tons That's of sellers. Of fun. Yeah, <laughs> there was like energy in the air with all the negotiations going back and forth, but we managed to get a bunch of good stuff. Mm -hmm. We just got done trying everything out at the driving range. We'll throw up some shot tracers and some eBay comps, see if we got any good deals. And we are gonna be giving away one of the clubs, so yes. stay tuned for the uh, details on how to enter that and which club that you might be able to win. Mm -hmm. But uh, let's get started. Let's get started with the non-golf stuff today because that was even cooler than some of the golf clubs we got. It's we got. Wow, we got a Pyrex. Yeah. The butter dish from my Crazy Daisy. Crazy Adding Daisy to the collection. Yeah. There we go. We're gonna have a full collection of uh, Crazy Daisy Pyrex here yep. soon. We'll have a video detailing the entire thing. The entire collection. <laughs> Probably not. But uh, we got some uh, Jordan 10s, I think these are. Not in perfect condition, but neither am I, so it doesn't really matter to me. Those are kind of cool. I like the uh, colorway. And then the bottom's really cool, too. It's got all of like his stats. Yeah, that's really cool. 94, 90. he's got a stat for every year, basically. Exactly. Goes all the way back to 85 Rookie of the Year scoring titles. Lots of uh, different things. Mm -hmm. But uh, the goat of uh, basketball. And then we also got this uh, PS2. I didn't even really want it. I was just kind of curious how much they uh, go for. So yeah. I asked how much they, uh, he was selling it it started at like 125 and then it got all the way down to like 80 dollars and i was yeah. looking it up you guys probably saw me look it up which is kind of awkward to do in front of a uh, seller he didn't care at all because no, he's always there and we always uh, buy golf clubs from him and end up being a good deal and there's like 50 games yeah. so we'll have fun playing with that and then i don't know if we'll sell it or not but it was fun to negotiate. It was fun to negotiate. That was a weird negotiation. <laughs> exactly. But uh, after that, we got uh, from uh, another one of our golf club guys, we got this uh, SpongeBob kids bag that we're going to save for one of the nieces or nephews. Mm. I don't even know if kids still like uh, SpongeBob. That's more our generation of stuff, but... Well. Oh well, it's oh, well. so cool. It's still pretty cool. But uh, let's get into the clubs. Also, we got this uh, Michelob bag, which is uh, super cool. But uh, lots of good clubs today. Let's get started, like oldest to uh, newest, yeah, cool. probably. We got the original Nike driver. I don't think Tiger ever used this one. I think David Duvall did, but Tiger took a while to come over. Probably wrong about that. But the original Nike driver actually hit it in. You actually hit it really good. Yeah, I was shocked because <laughs> it's like it's the size of like a three wood, so I was yeah. expecting to hit it well at all. And then we also got the uh, King Cobra SS nine wood. I didn't realize it was a nine wood. It just like shot straight in the air. It shocked me. I thought I hit it wrong. <laughs> yeah, I thought, uh, at first you thought that you popped it up because yeah, it went exactly. so high. I was like, what? Just yeah, happened? if you have a slower swing speed or just like don't like uh, irons, this is definitely something to look out for. The yeah. uh, higher lofted woods, and this is uh, definitely one that I would uh, recommend. They're mm -hmm. super cheap. Only goes for about thirty dollars. The original Nike one only goes for about like thirty dollars too. It's a very saturated market of yeah. the original Nike clubs. <laughs> the uh, Nike Sumos and Nike Squares uh, stuff still does uh, pretty good though. Yeah. And then uh, one of the uh, best drivers of all time, this and the M2 are usually my uh, top picks. Uh -huh. And the yellow truck guy is back. He's usually one of our favorite uh, vendors, but he like takes the summer off. He's like yeah. a snowbird. Mm -hmm. But we got a- Back uh, for the season. Yeah, back for the season. So he always has good stuff. He only had like four or five clubs out. Well, he had like 10 clubs out. But if you saw in his truck, he had like a thousand yeah, clubs. So he's still setting up. We'll definitely be uh, visiting him again next week. But the uh, Ping G30, like I said, one of my favorite drivers of all time that in the m2 and the r510 tp yep. and this thing still goes for a crazy amount of money we were sat there and talked to him for a while and these are like going more for that than like the ping g series which came out after it yeah. but uh, definitely a, a good driver super forgiving and long and then we also got uh from our other we have tons of uh, golf club guys now but uh, we got a couple of uh, wedges we got a Voki sm4 and this thing is actually cut down a little bit i didn't realize when we bought it and i was like man i should have uh, paid attention to that but it's actually kind of easy to hit now that it's like bent down maybe right. good for me too yeah it's cut down and then bent i got bent down wrong but <laughs> it's down. yeah it's uh bent. it's kind of like i don't know it almost makes it like a putter motion more so than like having to set your wrist and everything it's perfect for me yeah it's like a real square strike and then we got a, a classic re well, a remake of a classic we got the uh, Callaway Hickory series and I think this one has Mickey Mouse on it too which is uh, really cool and we I almost have a, a full set of the uh, Callaway Hickory things that came out with a wedge set and then a putter mm -hmm. so we're uh, collecting those and go out and have a hickory round with them there you go we I don't do know the old school like a tire too <laughs> yeah dress all the way uh, down into <laughs> What are the knickers? Yeah, I think so. And then I would wear like long dresses. It'd be interesting. Yeah, wear a tie with a dress. <laughs> and then uh, the club that we are actually going to give away and probably one of the more valuable ones besides the uh, Hickory Club and the uh, Ping G30 is the uh, Steelhead XR. And this thing, I thought it was gonna balloon. It's got a hazardous shaft in there and mm -hmm. a uh, almost brand new, uh, 
multi-compound yeah. grip so definitely a, a pretty good club and i thought this was going to balloon because a higher lofted uh, hybrids usually like go way too high and they spin too much but yep. that thing was actually really good kind of a penetrating ball flight while still going high mm -hmm. so low spin but high yeah you can't like be that. penetrating in high yeah conundrums <laughs> but uh, all you have to do if you want to uh, win that club is like the video be a subscriber and then comment if you guys have ever tried a high lofted hybrid or a high lofted uh, fairway wooden what's your thoughts on there it, there's i always used to like like i said i used to like stay away from them because they like ballooned way too much and they were hard to control especially into the wind but i don't know they're getting a little bit uh, easier to hit yeah. less spin so be a good Technology. option but if you want to win all you have to do is like the video be a subscriber and comment below whether you've tried long Those high things. lofted hybrids I'm not gonna long try. high lofted i don't know but i uh, hope you guys did like this video if you did hit like button and subscribe and we'll see, you next see you next time guys thanks for watching